Hey everyone, are you guys a Bruce Lee fan like I am? I grew up watching the Bruce Lee movies and that's actually why I got into martial arts. Well, what we have for you guys today is something that Bruce Lee uh, taught and created back in the 60s. It's called your PIA to your ABC or your progressive indirect attack to your attack by combination. Let's go ahead and get into the video. So in this video, we're going to go ahead and do uh, Jeet Kune Do and mix with some Cambodian boxing that Guru Dan and Asana taught us at a seminar a few years ago. Something that I find this is really fun with is going to be the elbow section. But to start, we do, in JKD, we call it progressive inner attack, or a PIA. And for the sake of this training, I just show each PIA as its own thing, but understand that any PIA can go with any combination. So, we have PIA, progressive inner attack. That means I fake something high to draw his attention up, or I draw him low, and then he goes low. So, I'm not going to attack where I fake. That's one of the biggest things I see when people are playing this game. So let's say I fake high, his hands come up, and then I throw a hook punch. Boom. Well, his hands are already there. So instead, you fake high so you can punch low. You draw the attention up, and then you blast low. And so when I fake high, I know I'm currently not in range. I need to get in range of the fight. So I'm going to pendulum step to get a kick to the leg. And I'm kicking to the leg one because it's lower than where his hands are, and two, it's easy. Anybody can probably kick that high, so this should be an easy drill for anyone to pick up and say, ah, oh, I get it. So I fake high, pendulum step in, kick low. Cross, hook, cross, kick, and get out of range. And that's number one. PIA to an ABC, and then get out of range. So, boom, kick, cross, hook, cross, kick, and get out. Now, here's where the Cambodian boxing comes in. So we got this one, we fake low to high. This is PIA number two. Fake low to high, I kick, cross, hook, cross, and before this hand leaves, I elbow, okay? So fake low, high, kick, cross, hook, cross, and we call this a crashing elbow. It doesn't go, it just hits, boom, boom, and it crashes in, okay? Low, high, kick, cross, hook, cross, crashing elbow. And in order to make this cooler, you've already got the elbow, we're going to kick them at the end. Because remember, I went low, high earlier, kick, cross, hook, cross, I ended with a kick. All of these end with a kick. And according to Guru Ram, all beginners, you kick one time. All intermediates and advanced, you kick two times. So you have a double kick at the end. So, low, high, kick. Cross, hook, cross to a crashing elbow. Now I give him a little push, and then I can kick him. Okay? I'm kind of already having to kick a little bit just to make it really fun for the camera. So, low, high, kick. Cross, hook, cross to the elbow. From here, I give him a little push. And I kick him. One more time. Low high, kick, cross to the, cross to the elbow, push to the kick. That's your second one. Now the third one. I think high, low, high, kick, cross, hook, cross to the elbow, grab, knee. The knee is replacing the kick. Okay, high, low, high, kick, cross, hook, cross, crashing elbow. Me. Um, as I was showing Garrett right before the video started, the idea behind this is he double covers. So I go one, two, here, that elbow goes right into that little pocket, and now I pull. Bam! I'm pulling. So he's kind of being overwhelmed. And now for the last one, I like this one. I think it's pretty cool. But you fake the rear punch. Not punching it. That's too many, too many of the guru dancings. <laughs> so for the last one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to let you mix them up. So you can fake high, fake low to high, or fake high low high. That's your choice. Okay, can we do high high? We did? Okay. <laughs> so at this point, you mix them all together. You want to fake high, kick, cross hook, cross, to the crashing elbow, to the knee, give them a little push, and then kick them. You're putting the whole combination of the end together, but you're deciding your, your intro, your entry. Maybe a fake low high, kick, cross hook, cross, elbow, knee, kick. 
High, low, high. Kick, cross, hook, cross, elbow, knee, and kick. One more time. Any entry you want. High, low, high. Kick, cross, hook, cross, crashing elbow, knee, em, kick. Em. I'm not doing a really aliveness version of this. Only one is camera and stuff like that. But just understand that when you do this high, low, high, probably going to be way out of range. Like you shouldn't even see me on camera on that one of these. And it's going to be high, low, high, boom, and you're coming in like with a wave of energy. Well, there you guys have it. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I like teaching it. This is one of my favorite things that I've learned from Guru Danny Nasano that is culminated from the Bruce Lee concept of Jun Fan Jeet Kune Do. Jeet Kune Do means what? Put in the comment section below. Let's see who knows what's going on in this, in this uh, YouTube world with JKD. So, you guys made it to the video. Please do me a favor. Hit that like button if you're liking the video. Go ahead and smash that subscribe button. As you can see right here, most of our watchers are not subscribers. And then last but not least, hit that bell icon, a ding ding, so you know the next video is coming out from myself, Coach J.D. Olson, here at Kishi Dojo Martial Arts Release in Sumter, South Carolina, where we bring you guys jiu-jitsu, total fighting concepts, uh, Jeet Kune Do, Filipino martial arts, and kickboxing. Awesome. You guys stay safe, keep training, and I'm out.